I want to point out, um, for a change, Samsung got some sense and they put the SD card, which is here, um, in a practical place. Uh, I would like it on the side, actually, but um, because this phone is slim. Before, I had a Samsung and I had to take out the battery to um, put in the SD card, which is quite impractical. As for the size of the phone, it's very slim, it'll fit in your back pocket. Or it is um, QWERTY. Um, I don't know if you can see this now uh, quite easily, but there's, there's a lot of um, functions on it. But uh, I do notice the trackpad. It can go a little erratic uh, at times. Um, you set the sensitivity, but uh, I think it's it's more to it's more to do with um, when the battery life is going a little low, it'll start um, it'll start acting up, and uh, it's quite a good phone. I use it for vlogging and social networking, so it's quite cheap too. Uh, you get it unlocked from Amazon for $119. I live in Ireland, so I bought this via Tesco Mobile. It's, um, it was only 55 I had to buy something in store to get it, but it's quite a good phone. It's, my own is not locked, but it comes with Wi-Fi and a few other things. The camera, I haven't really tried it that much, um, but I would say in the apps, one of your first things to do would be to download um, Opera Mini. This is because um, I'm just going to show you browsing in it. Uh, a lot of it's to do with my network here. I don't have a Wi-Fi. At home, I use mobile broadband, so it's it's much um, better with Opera because one of the problems I had was the phone browser. It would use the phone memory, so and not the external memory, and um, it was. A disaster. Um, I reviewed uh, two pages and uh, it said the memory is full. So I think the Samsung default internet browser it's it's kind of crap. It's, um, you find it. I just have to select. It will not uh, let you load too many. It'll use the very small memory that the phone has and it will waste it up in no length so I would not bother. 